That's a little brief introduction to my 86 Grand Wagoneer. Uh, I just picked it up about a month ago. Um, we're now in uh, low gear kind of testing this out. Um, I've driven back here. Um, it's in one of my other videos, a camping spot. I had the green truck here. Uh, but that's a different story and that's no longer with us. So I got this thing, uh, 360 carbureted unit. Uh, has a 727 automatic and the 228 uh, transfer case uh, so it's stuck in four, full time four wheel drive right now which is alright but um, it's meant to be like an all wheel drive so it's okay until you lock it into low now it's true 4x4 four four. Um, yeah a few little issues wrong with it but she's an old $500 unit so I um, hope you like these videos. I'm going to be doing most of my uh, backcountry stuff with this thing this summer. Uh, last summer was kind of a bust with the green truck. Spent too much money into it uh, so I couldn't get out to the backcountry to actually get this vlog up and running. So I hope you like this little short little blurb of the intro. We'll do a little walk about here in a second here and then uh, She Bear will film me going through a little water hole here up at the other end. And yeah, I'm just do a pan around. This back's full of camping gear right now. Um, this trail is uh, just west of Innisfail on the Red Deer River. So uh, I come here quite a bit. Um, our last camping trip, uh, I had a little video put up with us here out here with, like I said, the green truck. That was the last one of the season last year. Yeah, I don't know. I'm pretty impressed with this thing. I'm calling it Griswold. The Griswold Family Fun Wagon. Um, I don't know. I, I just get a kick out of it. And always wanted an old Woody wagon. And uh, actually, this is technically on the permit um, a station wagon, not an SUV. So I thought that was kind of funny. And here's our next stop here. to uh, put her on pause for a second and get set up. Get wild. 